Polanco, Mexico City. Welcome to Billionaire's Row. In reality though, there's only one and it's not located in Mexico. But let's be honest, these days everyone seems to be a billionaire. All the private jets are sold out and usually it's only billionaires who are in the market for a Rambo grade machine gun proof SUV. <laughs> we have ordered an Uber, an Uber Black because we are going to the richest neighborhood in Mexico City. Yeah, that's our guy. That one? That one? Yep. Look at this bad boy. <laughs> Hola, take us to DJ Khaled. So Polanco is the richest neighborhood in Mexico City. Just 27,000 residents live here. That's less than 0.1% of the entire city. For better or worse, it's a heavy contrast to what Mexico City is really all about. You, you don't want to fall out this car. Coolest Uber Black ever. Yeah, we don't have those in Europe for sure because you can't drive a car like that in Europe our streets are too narrow <laughs> plus Greta says no we'll be watching you welcome to Polanco this reminds me a lot of Singapore and maybe there's an apple shop I feel at home we can get our apple tags now oh yeah we need those because I am positive that on all these flights we have within Mexico we're gonna lose our suitcase once so this part of Mexico City is very posh and there is one guy that we can mainly thank for this type of environment that you have in this part well then Slim Shady. Carlos, well, the guy is called Carlos Slim and he actually made a museum in honor of his dead wife who died from cancer unfortunately. And his wife's favorite flower was actually roses so he's planted them himself. The museum itself is his private art collection. It's crazy. He's the richest man in Mexico and one of the richest men in the world. And we just spoke with one of the locals here actually, who said that a lot of locals are actually thankful for him because he helps building businesses and jobs and infrastructure yeah. in all of Mexico. But I will say that this is an area that does not represent what Mexico is all about. Yeah. This is like walking in any other big city basically, you know? Trust fun baby quarter. So Mexico City is actually one of the biggest financial center, centers in the world and Polanco is the center of Mexico City. <laughs> Look at this. That is so cool. Dog walking seems to be the new gig of the century. America taking over. Oh yeah, what, what, what? Fuck, Amelia. We almost got killed. He stopped the car, okay. <laughs> Hi, my brother! Hi, my brother! See you! I love you! The interesting thing about Polanco and the reason why it became the hotspot for rich people is that it's actually a safe zone from the earthquakes. That says a lot about how big of a deal the earthquakes really are. Oh, they are so thin. Still not used to it, three days in. I'm better today, but it's also slightly humid. I mean, just to give you an idea of how high we are, it is the equivalent of six Empire State buildings, 25% of Mount Everest, seven Eiffel Towers. Polanco is not just concrete jungle. No. There is actual jungle here, albeit yeah. very, very limited. What I like about this place is that a lot of the houses, they're actually covered in greenery. It's very beautiful. Yeah, because they're so ugly. <laughs> Meili, she's already house hunting. Meili, we can't afford it. Hola. Hola, ¿qué tal? <laughs> Even the squirrels love the tacos here. <laughs> Hi. De sætter sig rundt om øret. Sådan, sådan så dit øre bliver omfavnet, så det ser sygt flot ud på øret. Meili, you're messing up the audience retention. Welcome to the most expensive street in Mexico City. President Masakuk. <laughs> Emily, she's immediately glowing when she's walking here. I love this street. It's so cozy. All the restaurants and nice stores. I like it. So DJ Khaled is here, Amelia. Jorn, this is only in Mexico, okay? <laughs> what other country does a normal person, a normal person, need a car like this? If you buy a car like that, you're already saying, I'm doing something wrong. We had to check out this dealership. They even had our Uber Black for sale. Obviously, the car doesn't come with the actual bullet holes, but if you really need a car like this, you probably wouldn't mind. <laughs> <laughs> they did not like us inside the store, so we pretended we were in the market for a Cadillac. Here, Ocreso by El Cadillac.
We want to go in here and eat at Rosho because when we were in Cancun, we were actually meant to go out and have a nice evening out and party, but we couldn't because we were too tired. This one has the reviews of 4.9 on Google. How many reviews? 4,000. 4,000 reviews. Yes, we are whores for Google reviews ratings, but we've never seen anything like it. Plus, this is the first meal without tacos. Upon entering Ryoshi, we could immediately tell that this is a special place. The vibe, the ships, and the tasteful design of everything made us feel like we were hanging out with the cool cats. I just broke eight months of sobriety because he served me a Bloody Mary with alcohol, and then I took two big sips, and I was like, that's some thin tomato juice. I can already understand the reviews, although I haven't tried the food, but the service is crazy, the presentation is crazy, the cocktail is crazy. Now it's just up to the food. This is the Polanco way of dining. These restaurants are just lined up one after the other all the way down this street here. I mean, yeah, it's expensive, it's over the top, but as Amelia just said, it tastes amazing. You know, the more time we spend here in Mexico City, the more we realize how stigmatized Mexico City is from a Westerner's point of view. Mexico City is nothing as you are told before coming here. And this crab here, it's amazing. So from a Danish perspective, that was a very cheap meal we just had there. A hundred euros for a lot of food and incredible food as well. I would totally recommend this place. I was very naughty. I just bought a mushroom lamp. Not the kind of souvenir you would expect to find on the most pricey street in Mexico. No, that makes me wonder if you buy this in Oaxaca in two weeks, if you would have it for half the price. Probably. Don't ruin the moment. Okay, I won't. Sorry. We were quite surprised that all shops weren't exclusively catering to billionaire housewives. Of course you have the typical money doesn't buy you good taste stores, but generally we found the selection of stores to be a nice blend of Kim Kardashian's wardrobe and the stuff us mortals can afford. But then we found this mall. We are inside perhaps the most luxurious mall I have ever set foot in. Have you ever seen so many like high, high-end shops at the same place? In Singapore? Maybe, but this is next level. Nice malls always have nice toilets. We actually only went in here to find a toilet for Amelia. But now I'm depressed because I realize I have no money to buy any of all these wonderful objects that will make me happy for around seven minutes right after buying it. And then I have to buy more to get that same feeling. So I think this is what Polanco is. You know, it is high-end living. And if you love this kind of shopping, it's heaven. If not, you've seen it before. Just not this mall. And it's my and sauce. Let's go back to cheap taco stands. And as we leave Polanco, we downgrade to the Uber we deserve. That was Polanco, the richest neighborhood in Mexico City. Thank you guys for watching. Let us know what you think about the video. And remember to like and subscribe. Oh, Hit the bell button. We're doing that again. It's a biking burro. After a long walk back to our hood, we realized that this right here is what we love the most about a big city. We just found a coffee that kicks Starbucks in the butt. These small, cozy places with warm vibes and chill people will always win over the fancy, posh way of life. We like Polanka. But we love Roma Norte. Do we have more? Yeah. What's the next one? Because we have much more from Mexico. Si, sí, senor. But it says primary coverage includes the following insurance benefits. Primary coverage up to $35,000. Yeah, but another car. No, 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 no. <laughs>